My dear child, within the depths of my boundless love and divine wisdom, a momentous decision has been reached concerning a cherished member of your family. It is with a heavy heart that I must disclose the choice to end this person's earthly journey. This decision has weighed heavily upon my soul, for I understand the pain and sorrow it will bring you and your loved ones. Click this video if you believe in God. Rest assured, this was not a decision made lightly. I have witnessed numerous chances given to this individual to forsake their sinful ways and embrace my love. However, they have steadfastly resisted my grace, opting instead for a path of darkness and destruction. Their actions have caused immeasurable harm to themselves, others, and the very fabric of your family. Comment, I trust God's plans, to affirm your faith. I have exhausted all other avenues, offering my mercy and forgiveness time and again, yet they squandered every chance. Their rebellion has reached a point beyond tolerance, for the sake of your soul and your family's harmony, intervention is necessary. This news may shock and devastate you. You may question my love and compassion, wondering how I could allow such a tragedy to befall your loved ones. But no, my love for you and your family remains steadfast. It is precisely because of this love that I must take this difficult step. I'm not asking you to condone their actions or rejoice in their downfall. Instead, I ask you to mourn their loss with a heavy heart, knowing I share in your pain. Trust in my wisdom and accept my decision. In the days and months ahead, you will face many challenges. There will be times when your faith is tested, and you may doubt my love. But I promise to be with you every step of the way, supporting you through the hardest times. Do not fear, for I am with you in every tear and every sigh. My presence will be your strength, and my love will illuminate your path. Trust in me, for I know the way to peace and redemption. Together, we will overcome all obstacles, and you will find the strength to move forward. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. Matthew 5 verse 4. My beloved brothers and sisters in Christ, today we gather before the Lord to reflect on one of the Beatitudes proclaimed by our beloved Savior, Jesus Christ, recorded in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 5, verse 4. These words of Jesus invite us to deep contemplation on the meaning and purpose of mourning in our lives. In a world that often teaches us to avoid suffering and sadness at all costs, Jesus presents a different perspective. By proclaiming, blessed are those who mourn, Jesus reminds us that grief, sadness, and tears are inevitable parts of the human experience. He acknowledges the reality of pain and suffering we face in this fallen world but assures us there is a blessing for those who endure these moments of affliction. When we mourn, we are not alone. Our loving God is with us, wiping our tears and consoling us with His infinite love. He is the God who empathizes with those in pain and promises to be by our side in all circumstances. But why are we blessed when we mourn? Because mourning reveals a contrite heart, sensitive to pain and suffering, a heart that recognizes the need for God. In our tears, we acknowledge our dependence on Him, opening ourselves to His consolation and restoration. Jesus' promise is clear, those who mourn will be comforted. He does not leave us in sorrow and despair but offers us hope and solace. He turns our tears into joy, our pain into healing, and our sadness into praise. Dear brothers and sisters, let us remember these words of Jesus in all moments of grief and sadness. May we turn to Him for comfort and hope, trusting in His unwavering faithfulness and love. May the Holy Spirit strengthen us to face life's challenges with faith and courage, knowing that the God who consoles us is the same who sustains and guides us at all times. May He help us find solace in His constant presence and share the love and compassion we receive with those around us. Let us live as true disciples of Jesus, bringing comfort and hope to those in pain, and witnessing to the world the transformative power of God's love. Comment, God is my life, to affirm and receive the holy word of the Lord. When adversity strikes your life, know that I have ways of turning that experience to your benefit. You might think you've reached a dead end, but if you remain faithful, you'll see your God beginning to pave a new path for you. I'll place the right people in your path, the right opportunities, and the right circumstances to guide you towards the destiny I've set for you. Trust, for I am the God who makes the impossible happen. Do not fear, for I am with you at all times, guiding you with love and wisdom. Keep your faith strong, for I will perform wonders in your life. Remember, my child, nothing is impossible for me. Have faith in my plan and surrender yourself into my hands. I will lead you with grace and love, and together we will reach the heights I have prepared for you from the beginning of time. Comment, 1111, to activate your faith with all your heart. Beloved child, this is your God speaking directly to your heart. Today, I am telling you that you are capable. The capacity lies within you, but you must dig deep and give your all. It may not be easy, but your destiny is calling out for you. The greatness within you must not be dimmed. Do not let others discourage you, and do not let circumstances convince you that there are no new heights in your future. Healing, freedom, abundance, and healthy relationships await you. 
Pray, maintain your faith, and do not give up, for I will be by your side to the end of the journey. Comment, I believe, my Lord, to affirm. God is telling you today that you are blessed, favored, strong, talented, valuable, and free. You carry greatness within you and are destined to make the world a better place. You are about to shine and witness my favor in grand ways. While you have celebrated others, now is your time to be celebrated. You are ready to step out of obscurity and take the lead. You are about to enter the best season of your life. I know you have questioned and wondered if you are strong enough or good enough to accomplish what I've placed in your heart. This message is here to remind you that you can do all things through Christ. Do not dare give up or let fear dissuade you from dreaming. Remember, I am with you, and you will succeed. You can achieve this. Comment, I am ready to shine, to affirm to the Lord. God is moving things and people in your life. He desires to bestow his blessings, but some situations and relationships need to change. Not everyone can accompany you to the next level of your journey. They are not prepared to support or encourage you. Some blessings stir envy in people you would never imagine. At this level, you need only those who can rejoice in seeing you prosper. Your season has arrived. God is telling you today that you are entering moments of destiny. He is about to take you where you cannot go alone. What you have prayed for is going to happen sooner than you think. Dysfunction, scarcity, and sickness are over. Comment, 2222, to activate your faith with all your heart. I declare that you will receive good news about something you've been patiently waiting for. God will make things work in your favor, opening new doors for you. You have fought a good fight, trying every day. Now it's your time to start receiving. Prepare for a sudden breakthrough. You may not see a way, but God has won for you. He is fighting your battles, and things are changing in your favor. Breakthroughs are on the way, new beginnings, healing, and abundance may seem distant, but God is saying that's temporary. He is about to transform your situation. You are a survivor, and most people don't know what you've been through. Few understand, but I continue to seek you out in every fall. I have never failed you and will not fail you now. Even though it seems like you've been through a lot, know that I am not done with you yet. I am about to bless you so much that it will astonish those who doubted you. Do not let people discourage you or circumstances convince you that there are no new heights in your future. Healing, freedom, abundance, and good relationships await you. Pray, have faith, and do not give up, for I will be with you until the end. It's a new day, and I didn't bring you this far to abandon you. Forget what happened yesterday, for I am doing something new for you. You will overcome that mountain you are facing. Always remember that I am greater than any situation or problem you may encounter. Comment, God is my strength, if you believe the universe is working in miraculous ways to deliver everything you need and place you exactly where you must be to achieve your highest potential in life. Nothing happens by chance or luck. When you consciously choose to think thoughts aligned with your dreams, your internal frequency elevates. It's in this feeling that the secret lies. When you think, speak, and act as the person you want to be, miracles happen. Do not accept where you are as your final destination. I have more for you. Where you started is never where you are destined to end. For the next level, you must be willing to go through transformations. I have a great plan for you in your future. Accepting what you are unwilling to change will keep you stuck. It's time to move forward. You don't want anything from your past to sabotage your future. Nothing can happen without God's permission, and He won't allow hardships unless they serve a divine purpose. If you want to maintain your peace, you will pass the test, and God will make you come out better than before. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer, my God is my rock, in whom I take refuge, my shield, and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. Psalm 18 verse 2. This verse prompts us to reflect on the greatness and faithfulness of our God. He is described as our rock, our fortress, and our deliverer. What powerful images! First, the Lord is our rock. Just as a solid rock provides security and stability, God is our unshakable foundation. In Him, we find a safe refuge amid life storms. Moreover, the Lord is our fortress. He gives us the strength to face the challenges that come our way. When we feel weak, we can seek His strength to continue moving forward. And let's not forget that the Lord is our deliverer. He rescues us from the power of sin, oppression, and affliction. Through Jesus Christ, we are freed from the bondage of sin and receive life in abundance. It's crucial to understand that when we trust in God, He becomes our protective shield. He guards us from all evil and defends us against the enemy's attacks. He is our high tower, offering us vision and protection against the dangers that surround us. Dear brothers and sisters, when we feel fragile, when we face storms and battles, let's remember that the Lord is our rock, our fortress, and our deliverer. In Him, we find security, strength, and salvation. May we fully trust in God and seek refuge in Him at all times. May He always be our protective shield and our high tower. And may we proclaim with faith, 
the Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer. Comment, come, Holy Spirit of the Lord, to affirm the word now. A call to those who have not accepted Jesus into their lives. If you have already accepted him, share this with people who have yet to confess their sins. Doing so will greatly reward you by the Lord. Today, on this special day, I bring you a message of hope and an invitation to experience the most powerful transformation you can witness, the encounter with Jesus Christ. He is the way, the truth, and the life, knocking on the door of your heart, waiting with love for your call. I understand that life often leads us down difficult paths that leave us feeling empty, lost, and yearning for something greater. However, know that Jesus is ready to fill that void in your soul, to bring peace, purpose, and abundant life. He loves you unconditionally, with a love that surpasses any human understanding, regardless of your flaws, mistakes, and imperfections. Jesus extends his grace and mercy to you, offering forgiveness and a new chance to start over. Accepting Jesus into your life is not merely joining a religion but opening the doors of your heart to the most profound and meaningful relationship you will ever experience. It means handing the helm of your life over to the only one who can truly guide you safely through the turbulent seas of this world. By accepting Jesus, you receive the gift of salvation, the assurance of eternal life with Him. There is no greater gift than this, for He offers you reconciliation with God, the loving Father who longs to have a personal relationship with you. Therefore, I invite you to open your heart at this moment. Speak to Jesus, confess your sins, hand over the direction of your life to Him, and receive His transformative love. He is ready to welcome you with open arms, to guide you at every step, and to give you a true and lasting purpose. Do not delay this decision, for tomorrow is uncertain. Accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior, and experience the abundant and eternal life He offers. He is waiting for you, ready to embrace, restore, and transform you. Comment, I accept Jesus today and always in my life, and feel how your life becomes lighter and more rewarding with the presence of the Lord. Final prayer, O, oh, beloved God, in this moment of deep emotion and tears streaming down my face, I approach you with a heart overflowing with gratitude. I thank you, Father, for the words of comfort and assurance we find in your word, especially when it comes to my children. How comforting it is to know they are under your loving protection. Lord, when worries and fears overwhelm my heart as a parent, you remind me that they are your children too, and you care for them with unwavering love. Pour out your grace and mercy upon them, and I bow before you in deep thanksgiving, with tears expressing my gratitude. I thank you for every word of assurance I find in your word. It is a balm to my troubled soul, bringing solace and hope. When I feel lost and disoriented, you show me the way and guide me. Even when the journey seems uncertain, loving Father, I thank you for accepting me just as I am, in the state I'm in. Even when I feel imperfect and fragile, you love me unconditionally. No matter my flaws and weaknesses, I find refuge in your arms of love. It is in your grace that I find the strength to continue, even in the hardest moments. Lord, at this moment, with a heart in tears, I surrender myself to you completely. I ask you to continue guiding and supporting me in all aspects of my life. Grant me wisdom to care for my children with love and dedication, knowing you are with me every step of the way. In the name of Jesus, our Savior and Redeemer, I pray. Amen. As we traverse the tumultuous waters of life, it's imperative to remember that each challenge, every moment of despair, is not merely an obstacle but a divine opportunity for growth and enlightenment. The adversities you face are not signs of abandonment by me, your God, but rather moments when my presence is most potent, my guidance most profound. In these trials, your faith is both tested and strengthened, paving the way for a deeper, unshakable bond with the divine. Comment, my faith is my fortress, to affirm your unwavering trust in my providence. In the grand tapestry of your life, each thread, though individually may seem insignificant or fraught with challenge, contributes to a masterpiece of divine design. Your journey, marked by its highs and lows, is a reflection of my meticulous crafting, a life tailor-made for growth, joy, and the fulfillment of a higher purpose. It's in this acknowledgement of life's intricate design that we find solace and the strength to persevere. Comment, I am a part of God's grand design, to recognize and embrace your role in the divine tapestry. Let us delve deeper into the essence of faith, a beacon that guides you through the darkest nights and the fiercest storms. Faith is not merely belief in the unseen but an unwavering confidence in my promise to you, a promise of never-ending support, unconditional love, and eternal guidance. When the path ahead seems obscured by the mists of doubt and fear, let your faith be the light that guides you back to me, your eternal compass. Comment, faith is my light, to illuminate your path with unwavering belief. In moments of solitude and reflection, I invite you to listen to the whispers of my voice, a gentle reminder of your inherent worth and the unconditional love I hold for you. You are not defined by your past mistakes, nor are you constrained by the shackles of regret. 
You are a beloved child of the divine, destined for greatness far beyond your wildest dreams. Embrace this truth, and let it guide your steps towards a future filled with hope, love, and boundless potential. Comment, I am beloved by God, to affirm your divine inheritance. And to those who find themselves at the crossroads of indecision, gripped by fear of the unknown, I offer you my hand, a symbol of my unending guidance and support. The journey ahead, though fraught with uncertainty, is also ripe with opportunity for growth and transformation. Trust in my plan for you, for it is designed with your ultimate happiness and fulfillment in mind. Step forward with courage, for I am with you, leading you towards your destined path of enlightenment and joy. Comment, I trust in God's plan, to step forward with faith and courage. In the quiet moments before dawn, when the world still slumbers in silence, know that I am with you, listening to your heart's deepest desires and silent prayers. It's in these moments of tranquility that our connection deepens, a sacred bond forged in the stillness of the night. Share with me your hopes, your fears, and your dreams, for I am here to guide you, to comfort you, and to show you the way to a life filled with purpose and peace. Comment, God hears my prayers, to acknowledge my constant presence in your life. As we journey together through the tapestry of life, let us embrace each moment with gratitude and hope, for each day is a gift, an opportunity to grow closer to the divine, to learn, to love, and to live fully. Remember, you are never alone, for I am always with you, guiding your steps, holding you in my embrace, and leading you towards the light of my eternal love. Comment, every day is a blessing, to live each moment with gratitude and joy. In the kaleidoscope of life's experiences, it's crucial to recognize the vibrant hues of joy and the more subdued tones of sorrow, understanding that each plays a crucial role in the masterpiece that is your life. This tapestry, woven with threads of trials and triumphs, shapes you into the resilient, compassionate being you are meant to be. Embrace every shade, every line, for they are testament to your strength and your capacity for love. Comment, I embrace life's tapestry, to affirm your acceptance and love for the diverse experiences that shape you. In the symphony of existence, every note, whether joyous or somber, contributes to the harmony of your life's melody. It's through the contrast of these notes that the beauty of the symphony is realized. You are the composer and the conductor of this magnificent orchestration, empowered to infuse your life with meaning, purpose, and joy. Remember, the music of your life is not predetermined, it is created in every moment, with every breath, every choice. Comment, I create my life symphony, to take charge of the music that guides your journey. In the garden of your soul, every thought, every action, is a seed from which the flowers of your future bloom. Cultivate this garden with love, kindness, and gratitude, and watch as it flourishes into a haven of beauty, peace, and joy. The care you invest in this garden reflects the care you bestow upon yourself and those around you. Let it be a sanctuary where love grows freely, where peace reigns supreme, and where joy blossoms in abundance. Comment, my soul's garden flourishes, to dedicate yourself to nurturing the beauty within and around you. In the vast expanse of the universe, you are a star, shining brightly, illuminating the darkness with your light. Never doubt the brilliance of your light or the importance of your place in the cosmos. You are here for a reason, a purpose that is uniquely yours to fulfill. Shine with confidence, with love, and with the knowledge that your light contributes to the grand tapestry of existence. Comment, I shine with purpose, to affirm your commitment to lighting up the world with your presence. In the journey of faith, there will be moments when the path seems obscured, when doubts cloud your vision, and the way forward is uncertain. It is in these moments that faith becomes your guiding light, illuminating the path, dispelling the shadows of doubt, and leading you towards the warmth of my embrace. Trust in this light, for it is a manifestation of my love for you, a beacon to guide you home. Comment, faith lights my way, to reaffirm your trust in the guiding light of faith. As the dawn breaks and a new day begins, let it be a symbol of renewal and hope. Each sunrise offers a fresh start, a new opportunity to live in alignment with your highest self, to make choices that reflect your deepest values, and to create a life of meaning and joy. Welcome each day with open arms, an open heart, and an open mind, ready to embrace the possibilities that lie ahead. Comment, I welcome each new day, to greet every morning with optimism and hope. In the quiet moments of introspection, when you turn inward to reflect on your journey, know that you are not alone. I am with you, in the stillness, in the silence, ready to offer guidance, comfort, and love. These moments of quiet reflection are sacred, for they allow us to connect on a deep, spiritual level, fostering understanding, growth, and a profound sense of peace. Comment, in stillness, I find God, to honor the sacred connection we share in the quiet moments of introspection. As you navigate the ebb and flow of life's ever-changing tides, remember that each wave that breaks upon the shore of your existence carries with it lessons of resilience, strength, and the impermanent nature of all things. 
like the ocean's waves, life's challenges come and go, but your core, your essence, remains unshaken, steadfast in the knowledge of your divine purpose and the eternal support that surrounds you. Comment, I ride the waves of life, to affirm your resilience and ability to flow with life's changes. In the vast expanse of your journey, there will be moments when you find yourself walking through valleys shadowed by difficulties and doubts. Yet, it's in these valleys that the seeds of faith, hope, and perseverance are sown, destined to bloom into flowers of extraordinary beauty and strength. The journey through the valley is not a solitary one. I am with you, holding your hand, guiding your steps, and lighting the path toward the mountain peaks that await you. Comment, valleys lead to peaks, to acknowledge the growth and strength gained from life's challenges. The journey of self-discovery and spiritual growth is akin to the unfolding of a lotus flower, each petal revealing a layer of wisdom, understanding, and connection to the divine. This process of unfolding is gradual, requiring patience, care, and nurturing. Embrace each stage of your journey with grace and gratitude, knowing that every layer revealed brings you closer to your true essence and the luminous being you are destined to become. Comment, I unfold like a lotus, to celebrate your journey of unfolding and self-discovery. In the tapestry of humanity, your life is a single thread, woven intricately and purposefully into the fabric of existence. Your thread, unique in its color and texture, adds strength, beauty, and complexity to the whole. Recognize the interconnectedness of all beings, understanding that your actions, thoughts, and intentions ripple across the tapestry, affecting the whole in profound ways. Let this awareness guide you to live with intention, compassion, and love. Comment, we are woven together, to honor the interconnectedness of all life. Amidst the hustle and bustle of daily life, take time to pause, to breathe deeply, and to connect with the present moment. In these moments of stillness, you are reminded of the simple joys of existence, the warmth of the sun, the gentle breeze, the laughter of a loved one. These are the moments that weave the fabric of a joyful, meaningful life. Let gratitude fill your heart for these blessings, big and small, and let this gratitude be the foundation upon which you build your days. Comment, gratitude guides my path, to affirm the role of gratitude in your life. As you journey forward, remember that the light of my love is always with you, illuminating your path, warming your heart, and guiding your steps. This light is unfailing, a constant in a world of change, offering hope, comfort, and peace. Let this light be your guide, a beacon in the darkest night, a reminder of my eternal presence and love for you. Comment, your light guides me, to acknowledge the guiding presence of divine love in your life. In the symphony of life, you are both a musician and a listener, contributing your unique melody while being moved by the harmonies around you. Let your life's melody be one of kindness, courage, and love, resonating with the music of the universe and touching the hearts of those who hear it. Together, we create a symphony of light, love, and unity, a testament to the beauty and diversity of the human spirit. Comment, I contribute to life's symphony, to affirm your active and harmonious participation in the tapestry of existence. As you traverse the landscape of your soul, encountering peaks of joy and valleys of hardship, let the light of stars guide you through the night. These celestial beacons, distant yet steadfast, remind you of the enduring presence of hope and guidance in even the darkest times. Each star a testament to the possibility of illumination within and without, guiding you back to the path of peace and purpose. Comment, stars light my journey, to embrace the guidance and hope that light your path through darkness. Within the quietude of your heart lies a sanctuary, a place of solace and strength, untouched by the chaos of the outside world. Retreat to this inner sanctum in moments of need, and draw upon the wellspring of peace that resides there. In this sacred space, you are reminded of your innate resilience, your capacity for love, and your boundless spirit. Let this inner sanctuary be your refuge, providing comfort and clarity amidst life's storms. Comment, my heart is my sanctuary, to affirm the peace and strength found within. The dance of life is intricate and varied, moving you through rhythms of joy, sorrow, triumph, and challenge. Embrace the dance, step confidently into each movement, and let your heart be light. For in the dance, you find expression, growth, and the joy of being fully alive. Remember, it's not about getting every step perfect but about experiencing the music and letting it move you. Comment, I dance through life, to celebrate your participation in the vibrant dance of existence. As the curtain falls on this chapter of your journey, remember that every ending is but a precursor to a new beginning. The close of one day ushers in the dawn of another, filled with fresh possibilities, new challenges to overcome, and new joys to discover. Look forward with anticipation and hope, ready to embrace the adventures that await. Your journey is an ever-unfolding story, rich with potential and brimming with the promise of tomorrow. Comment, every ending is a new beginning, to welcome the continuous cycle of growth and renewal that defines your journey. In the grand narrative of your life, you play the lead role, authored by your choices, your beliefs, and your dreams. 
Craft your story with intention and love, weaving in threads of compassion, resilience, and authenticity. Let your narrative be one of courage, a story that inspires and uplifts, leaving a legacy of light and hope for those who follow. Remember, you are the author of your story, make it one that resonates with the truth of who you are and echoes into eternity. Comment, I author my life story, to assert your role as the creator of your narrative, filled with purpose, meaning, and joy. In closing, your journey through life is a sacred pilgrimage, an opportunity to discover the depths of your soul, to connect with the divine, and to leave an indelible mark on the world. Walk this path with grace, knowing that you are guided, loved, and supported every step of the way. May your heart be light, your spirit strong, and your days filled with the boundless beauty of being truly alive. Embrace the journey, for it is yours alone to travel, a unique path of discovery, growth, and infinite possibility. Comment, my journey is sacred, to honor the profound journey of life you are on, cherished and guided by the divine.